Welcome to Seward, Alaska, a picturesque town nestled on the shores of Resurrection Bay. Here's a sneak peek of our recent shore fishing trip. Today we take you on an exciting journey into the heart of salmon fishing. We will explore the end of salmon fishing here in Seward, Alaska. With the season winding down, there are far fewer people here. If you found it difficult to find a camping spot in Seward, Alaska, you're in luck. There are plenty of spots available now. Two weeks ago was the peak of the Silver Salmon Run in Seward, Alaska. There were plenty of fish to go around and almost everybody was catching their limit. Things have slowed down a little bit since then. Every year, Seward becomes a hub of activity as anglers from around the world gather here to try their luck at catching the prized silver salmon. Before heading out to the water, it is important to have the right gear. Seward offers a few different options to find what you need for the successful fishing trip. Here at Be Outdoors Alaska, we have learned over the past couple years some of the best techniques and fishing spots here in Seward, Alaska. A week ago, things had slowed down from the previous week, but it was still a great opportunity to catch silver salmon. The waters of Resurrection Bay are teeming with silver salmon. Salmon season in Seward usually runs from June to the end of September with peak usually July and September. Fishing for salmon requires strength, patience and skills. These fish are known for their size and strength for an epic battle. Landing salmon is not only a thrilling experience, but a rewarding one. Many Alaskans live off of salmon during the cold winter months. As the sun sets on another salmon season, we make plans to come back next season and enjoy the chase as we explore the wonders of Seward, Alaska. So it appears that for every four fishermen, one fish is caught. This time of year, it's always hit and miss. This video is brought to you by Be Outdoors Alaska. Plan your next fishing adventure and experience the thrill of salmon fishing, one of the most breathtaking locations on earth in Seward, Alaska. Seward, Alaska has a population of 2,717 people as of the 2020 census. Seward is the fourth largest city in the Kenai Peninsula Borough behind Kenai, Homer, and the borough seat of Soldotna. The city is named for U.S. Secretary of State William H. Seward, who orchestrated the United States purchase of Alaska from Russian Empire in 1867, while serving in this position as part of President Andrew Jackson's administration. Seward is the southern terminal of the Alaskan Railroad and the historic starting point of the original Iditarod Trail to the interior of Alaska with mile zero of the trail marked on the shoreline of the southern end of town. One of our next videos will be filmed the day after this was filmed and we will be shore fishing from Seward, Alaska for halibut and cod. Now on to the current fishing report. The catch rate has slowed down substantially. 
There are reports of more salmon schools yet to come in, but so far nothing has appeared. With the crowds gone, right now is an excellent time to have a beach all to yourself. There are salmon that are still coming in, but usually in groups of two to three salmon at a time. You will still see the whale watching boats still head out. If you'd like to see Seward without all the crowds, now is an excellent time.